hi welcome back to rebecca's travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle i would like to say first of all um if you please subscribe to my channel pr uh, press the red and white button subscribe button also if you ring the notification bell then i uh, it will send you future videos that I upload at least three times a week at the moment for my travel channel and four times a week for my lifestyle channel. So thank you for doing that. And um, the video or vlog that I'm going to be doing today is the latest travel news from around the world part one this week so let's jump right into it now according to breakingtravelnews.com and um, the following 10 facts basically are the latest travel news uh, that um, again that you need to know or you can again celebrate now and for a celebration um number one is spain revamps tourism website as in industry restarts again nor a new tourism campaign entitled back to spain which is a fabulous name that i think we can again celebrate um, because it's such a popular uh, popular destination uh, with uh, UK tourists or just tourists in general and um, I've been to Spain many times and I think it's a fantastic beautiful country again that has um, a lot of amazing sights to see and Uh, again the locals are friendly as well and again you can view um, some of my Spanish videos um, on my travel channel uh, called on Rebecca's Travels and you can again get to feel what Spain is like Um, or at least parts of Spain, what parts of Spain is like and um, you can also see from travel books or over the internet as well um, next is Ryanair is to cut island flights as quarantine remains Ryanair will cut a number of of flights it offers between the UK and Ireland from next month in res response to what the brand has defective quarantine measures of the Emerald Isle so again it's a good idea if it's again not safe to travel to Ireland um, at the moment so everybody is safe I hope um, Ryanair uh, will as soon as safely as possible resume flights when it's safe to do so and um, but again it's uh, just the best um, at the moment for next month if it's not safe to go back to Ireland yet and so again i would check if you are traveling to ireland next month with ryanair that your flight is going and if not then you'll have to change it or um try and get a refund um next up is Ethero has rolled out um, some safety and secure technology which is absolutely uh, brilliant news and that's 
absolutely great to celebrate and um, so passengers and staff feel more secure again at Heathrow Airport so again well done and um, again it just it gives customers and staff better experience number four Rosewood Porto Servo is scheduled to reopen in 2022 that's another thing to celebrate hopefully it'll go as safely and as brilliant as possible for start at staff and customers number five malaysia airlines launches a new safety awareness campaign which is absolutely brilliant news for the staff and customers um so obviously you would need to check if you're traveling with malaysian airlines or with any airline what the new safety measures are before you travel and um, number six unfortunately austrian airlines cancels flights as it banned reinstated so if you're traveling with austrian airlines or to austria or you are say traveling from austria to another country then again check if uh, your flight is going to be going because um they have cancelled a lot of flights so hopefully austrian airlines will be able to get back up as quickly and as safely as possible um obviously when it's safe to do so for customers and staff um number seven conrad punter demitter to debut opening september this year so that's great to celebrate um yay and i hope it goes as safely as possible for both staff and customers so well done and um, number eight virgin atlantic announces at 1.2 billion recapitalization so I think they're going to be rebranding Virgin um, Atlantic, which again is excellent news. And um, number nine, green shot in Abu Dhabi tourism sector. Hotel is occupying rates in Abu Dhabi have risen by 3% year on year since the 1st of July and is expected to rise in the future so that's absolutely fantastic news um, for Abu Dhabi uh, tourism sector so um, that looks like it's well on the way to being revitalised and um, it's getting even more people to travel there it looks absolutely fantastic and brilliant so well done and number 10 dubai um again also in uh, the arab emirates reopens to international tourism so that's excellent news and that looks like absolute brilliant place to go and visit um and it just looks amazing and fa fantastic um, on uh, photos both Abu Dhabi and Dubai gosh there's so many places in the world that look absolutely amazing and fantastic and are just um, <laughs> great to visit um, look so I would say thank you for watching um, please like, subscribe and I'll see you in my next travel video uh, which is going to be tomorrow and it's going to be on what is else is going to be opening in the UK 
either now or soon uh, within the next month um, to what the government announces so please stay tuned for that video and um, I wish everybody um, it's safe and I love you all you all mean the world to me subscribers and viewers and bye for now and I'll see you tomorrow thank you bye